like a nice bunker shot. That's the, that's the <laughs> flight. <laughs> that's the flight? Yep. What stick are you swinging? I got a seven. Okay. Let me get a little video of you from both directions. It's definitely gotten more fillet than it used to be though. Yeah, it's pretty filleted. Filet. You played Quintero one time, you hit driver off the deck, 250 up the hill, it was like perfect. <laughs> <laughs> He's serving up the filet mignon. Yes. My swing growing up used to be very, roll. I rolled the wrist a lot, and then, then I got kind of to where I'd be scared, and now I'm kind of going back to late offy, but. Okay, so a little pull cut. Let me get one from face on, and then we can have a little powwow and about how we're going to make you better. All right. A lot. Okay. So, <clears throat> let's just take a look at this. We'll look at it from down the line first. So when you swing that club back, mm -hmm. see, see the top of your swing? Yeah. Super laid off. And then you've got to tumble that club like crazy to get the face squared back up. See how that works? Yeah. Hard to hit it very hard with that pattern going on. And when we look at it from face on, look at your grip. I can't see the logo on yeah, your grip at that's all. Crazy, right? Right. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna we're gonna tinker with that quite a bit because you have one of the weakest grips I've ever seen on the golf club. Okay. <laughs> Usually when I see a weak left like that, I don't see the right hand weak like that also. Come look at this, Henry. It's amazing. Double weak. Weak yeah. is right hand over the top. Yeah. You got like a and an open face. So he's got the face open, yeah. the grip super weak in both hands. I mean, he's got more cow left and Rory right. Yeah, they don't match. <laughs> And then because of that, I'm guaranteeing he's going to hit this ball, like, behind himself. It would be really hard to keep that face square to close. So see how he's going to hit it back behind his, yeah. like, way back there. And that's amazing that you even get it as square as you do. So you've got a lot of bow and twist to, yeah. to get that The to reason happen. visually in my head that I set the club open... It's just so my body knows to just shut it as much as it can to get, if, if, it, if it's square to the target, I feel like it's going to even be more to the right. So I open it, that way I can try to just shut it. Well, you just shut you, it. you go like this as hard yeah. as you can. Yeah. I can see that's, that's your squaring mechanism. Yeah. So what I want to try is I want to get that grip on significantly stronger in okay. each hand but okay. mostly the left, like a lot stronger okay. in the left, a little stronger in the right. And then I want to change some of the dynamics of how your backswing works. Okay. And we're going to do it a little slowly. I'm going to have you hit some push draws. All right. So what it's going to look like, can I borrow your club? Yeah. So if I take my hands off the golf club and I let them just dangle like this, see how my wrist and my elbow are rotated this way? Mm-hmm. They're not this way. So I want you to put the, the hand on the golf club somewhat how they naturally hang. Okay. And then the other hand's going to go on so that the lifeline sits right on the side of the thumb. Right there like that. Got it. Okay. Now on our backswing, we're going to feel this golf club stand up. Okay. And lay down. Okay. Where you're the other way. You're right. this way, that right. way. We're going to just reverse your pattern completely. Got it. And have you hit some balls? I want the ball to fly like this. For right, a minute. Okay. Okay. Take this one off for a second. Put that one in the fingers like that. You know what that feels like? Yep. See where the logo is pointed? Mm -hmm. Now put this one on. It's going to feel like it's under. That's different. And then vertical okay. and then. Swing it back under. to me. I'm going to feel the face stay this way. So feel yeah. how the face stays pointed kind of toward the ball. Yep. Now turn your, keep turning. Now change directions, and this is going to feel like it's back here like this, coming from behind you into the ball like that. Can you do it in slow motion for me? There you go. So keep the right hand a little more under. Start over. 
Right hand a little, both hands stronger. You went back weak again. <laughs> okay. okay. Sure. Now, feel the face stay pointed down, stand it up. Good. So keep it square and then kind of it's, keep it square to the ball. So it's gonna feel square, standing up like this. Now just give me more turn of the chest. Turn, turn, turn. Now just change directions. There you go. Okay. That's the pattern. <laughs> Still wanted to lay it off. But you hooked it. Yeah, I went left. <laughs> Give me a really strong grip. Feel like your hands are on the side of the golf club. Good. Now swing it up. Nice big wind up. Okay, we got hooks now. <laughs> now we just have to get the path more from the inside. Yep. And the way we're going to get that more from the inside is to get the club to stay standing up longer. Okay. So swing it back here to me. Now keep going up. Now you've got to turn. Feel where that is? Yep. Now go ahead and hit it from there. Go back up there. There you go. Home run. <clears throat> Feel that? Mm -hmm. So a lot of it seems like I just got to get a bigger turn too to kind of help. Well, right? you yeah, you've got to turn. You've got to get your chest turned. So nice strong grip, turn your chest more, widen that out, feel that? Yep. Okay. Hit it from here? Start over and get up there and hit it. Be patient, turn all the way up to there. Close. You can't even go strong enough, just put those hands on sideways. <laughs> <laughs> the opposite, huh? You guys are the exact opposite. But you both flip at it. To you flip it left and he slices it. Getting closer. At least we got the ball turning left now. Are we trying to hook it still or? I want you to, I want it to turn left, but I want the ball to start. Kind of the red flag. Yeah, give me another stick. Your rehearsals are good now. So now you have hope. Okay. You have hope. Was it? Make the ball start over here. Okay. His rehearsals have some hope now. Make sure the grip's strong. And just start it way the crap over there. There you go. Nice little push draw. Yeah. We're still a little too late off. We still have some of the old patterns in there, but they're a lot closer. Okay. I want you to go slower okay. for me. Slower. Wind it all the way up. I'm going to give you a feel coming down. So wind it up to how we want it. I want you to feel like this is more pointed okay. that way. Let this wrist feel like it's got... There you go. Feel what that feels like? Mm -hmm. Now change directions. So you're going to feel like you're into the ground. You're going to feel like the face stays this way. Got it. Feel your wrists. Yep. Feel where the club is. Yep. Keep turning. Feel where the club is. Yep. Okay, that's what I want you to feel. Look, oh, nope, it's not enough. That way. That way, okay. Turn your chest. There you go. Well, we went from nothing but slices to the right to nothing but draws to the left. Yeah, now. that's that's good. Somewhere in the middle. No, we want to just start it farther right now. Okay. Because you got the pat, the ball's flying pretty good. It's not really curving that much. It's just not starting far enough to the right. Stronger grip. Make that thing start over there to the right. Where did it start? A little left of where we wanted. Yep. Not bad though. We're winning. He's one that could feel like he gets it like nine miles across the line. Yeah. yeah, totally. And he would not even, if he'd felt like Matt Wolf, he'd probably look not quite normal. Still be a little laid off. That's getting better though. Yeah. More exaggerated, shut face and across the line. Give me a strong, strong grip. Hands gonna feel like they're on the side. Mm -hmm. Okay, now swing it back to me here. 
we're going to feel that. Now as we come up, keep turning, keep turning, keep turning, keep turning. Feel that. Oh, you want me to, okay. I want you to actually feel like that. There's no... Turn it up versus lifting it up. Yeah. And that face will fit. Face That's closer. So turn it up. And then... Hold on, do that one more time. Turn it up. Yeah. <laughs> Make it feel like the head... I want you to feel like the head is on top of your head. Okay, that's a good... There's can... no way you can do it. Not a chance. <laughs> good, do that. Get it on top of your head and then hit it. Got it. Oh. <sighs> that's the one. Come on, baby. So I wanted to give you a sneak peek into MiloLinesGolf.com, an online academy devoted to helping you play better golf and learn to swing like an athlete. So I've assembled a, an awesome team of instructors to help me with this mission. And we've received some awesome feedback from the members of our site, and we've seen many of them make great strides toward improving their games. As a member of MiloLinesGolf.com, you get a monthly evaluation from myself or my team. You get a private space to track your progress. You also receive access to a live lesson library, and a really large library of how-to videos. Access to our member-only webinars, and you get to ask us questions to be answered live. You can have access to all these great things and much, much more. So let us help you play the best golf of your life. So visit us at the link below and join now. That was so much closer. It, it probably feels like this with your right hand. So that's the feeling. I want to feel like it's going, because then it's really just about vertical or wherever it's, it's supposed to be. It's getting close to parallel to the target line at the top. Right, okay. Which is... It's going to feel like that face is really strong. Yep. In the back so your face is going to feel like it points like this. Swing it to me. So, you, yeah, there you go. You're going to feel like the face, feel how that face is down. Yep. Now from there, you're going to feel like this goes, turn, turn, keep turning. Turn, 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 turn. Now hit it! <laughs> now you don't need to roll your wrists at all. That was from the inside. Do that again and don't roll your wrists over. Okay. Okay. Do that again. Turn it back. Turn, turn, turn. Keep turning, 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 turning. Okay. Good. Now we got you into, we turned you into a complete hooker. Yeah. Watch out, the ball's going twice as far. It really but is, yeah. Twice as left. Twice as far <laughs> left. <laughs> so now here's the key. We've got to figure out how to get you to the ball without doing this. Right. So that was your method of squaring it up. Right. You were so laid off and so open, and then you would tumble the club like this and shut it. Right. There's still a, an element of that in your motion. Okay. We have to quiet this down, and you've got to feel like the club stays over here and you just go, see how I'm just turning? Yeah. If I'm turning and I do this, I get a double whammy left. Right. Now we don't need as much of this stuff. Yep. That's a hard pattern to break out of. Yeah, he's got to get rid of the flippage. Good. A little more right wrist feeling like back like that. Good. So, Feel that? Yep. Mm -hmm. Now go in slow motion down to impact. So keep turning, keep the left hip going around. Boom. Where's that ball going to go? Right. With a draw. It's going to start right, yeah. It's going to start right and it's going right, to draw. Right, Okay, so do that. Give me that feeling. Okay. There you go. A little push draw. Yeah. That's different, right? The hardest part seems like just the turn. <laughs> oh my goodness. Did you see that? It's amazing when your hands can start understanding that, like, you don't need to do this and this. It's like, oh. Okay. If we can eliminate how much twist we have in there, life gets really easy as far as squaring that face up. Okay, so here's what you're going to do with this. Okay. It's going to rest on your right arm at address. Mm -hmm. As we swing it back, it's going to go onto your left arm, and then you're going to feel like it stays on oh, your okay. left arm through the strike. Okay. So we're not going to flip it back to the right. Right. Give me a few with... You're just going to hit those little punters. Yeah, we're going to hit little chip shots. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, right? And then once it's on the left, stay on the left, it right? It stays on the left. Yeah. Do it again. So turn it up. On the right to the left. Set right to left and wind your body up. 
that's getting better. Do it again. Wind up. There we go. Feel how that feels like it's a, to you that feels super crossed up, right? We could actually have a little bit more lift in your arms. Yeah. Now leave it on there and just, doom. Feel that? Mm -hmm. and just hit me little chippers. If it gets past the red flag, then you hit it way too hard. Got it. Make sure your hand's on strong. Good. That looks right. That's the right idea. It's a hard one. He's used to throwing all the angles out, and so his radius is built off of lengthening everything out. So swing it back here again. Okay, so feel how you've got this lever system built. Mm -hmm. If we keep this intact, turn back to the ball. How far above the ball are you going to be? Right, a lot. So what do you have to do to make up for it? Yeah, do what your instinct said. Yeah, lower your lower at the hips and the knees. There you go. Feel that? Yep. Okay, right idea. He needs to feel this stay this way. Now just turn. Which way back? Yeah. Feel where the club is? Yeah. Keep it on your left arm. There you go. I feel like that club face is pointing back at me. Yeah, that's a good. Yeah. How about that? Make the club face point at Henry. Now change directions. That's really good. He just has such a hard time not wanting to, yeah, <clears throat> he wants to rotate, whoop, and lay it all off. It's got to feel like it stands up, points back at Henry, and it's more that direction. Feel how that's kind of away from you, and it feels across. Mm -hmm. There you go. Woo! That needs to be the swing. <clears throat> okay. Let's take that off, and I want you to hit two more good ones. Okay. And we're gonna send you home with homework. Yeah. You're gonna learn to, you're gonna it's pretend you're Matt Wolf for a while. But he needs to turn it the whole way. Turn, don't lift your arms at all. Keep turning, keep turning. There, there we are. Now from there, go ahead and just hit a little pitch out to the right. There you go. Feel that? Yeah. You have to make enough turn, otherwise you just lift it and roll it. So it's gonna feel like your chest is doing all of the backswing work. Feel that? Yeah, I just don't know if I, I don't think I can get there without help. <laughs> yes, you can. There you go, you did it. You All have right. plenty of mobility, you All just right. don't know what to do. That's pretty good. Yeah. Okay, one more. Okay. And that's gonna be your homework, is to just- Turn. Train yourself to, to turn the club back. Don't lift it and roll it. Up, feel like the hit club's on top of your head. Club was still laid off. It's going to take some time. <laughs> <laughs> in and shut. In and shut? Out and open. Like, yeah, like that. In and shut. But he's still got to get his arms to go up. But, it, but he's already doing that first. Maybe that would get him. Maybe. Let's feel it. In and up. So feel like your hands go. Towards you? In here and closed. Keep the face this way. Now from there, turn, turn, up. Feel that? Mm -hmm. Now do it on your own. So feel like the face is closed, in, up. Now turn, turn, turn. That's different. Last ball. Last ball. And then I'm giving you your homework. Okay. That's good. Hey, okay. This was like. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Wow, that's way better. You hit it like crap, but it was way better. The motion was good. Was that the last one? Yeah. Look at that. At I top. think I just felt more free, like more free, and like feel the positions, but kind of just I think kind of naturally try to get it there. I think there's a little bit of you that wants to go this and start it down the line. Or yeah. And then it goes this. Yeah. For sure. If you can feel shut and in. Well, that's why if it's turn. If it's all turn. If your arms are just connected to you like this and you turn, see where your hands go? Mm -hmm. If I go here, now I naturally want to get up here and lay that sucker off. Yeah. So if you can just feel like it's just turn. Yeah. That's better. I feel like that toe is down to the ball and you just. So that's going to be your homework. I want you to spend 15 minutes a day. You don't even need a ball or maybe just like a, a wiffle ball or something at home. Yeah. 
15 minutes a day, you're going to go turn, face is going to stay down, stand it up, lay it down, start the ball on the right side of whatever you're hitting at. Okay. It's going to turn left now. Yeah. It's not going to turn right. Yeah, none of them went. You didn't hit one ball that turned right once right. we changed your grip and yeah. the pattern. Right. Okay. All right. Okay. Thank you. My pleasure.